Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum, my dear students. How are you? I hope you are enjoying the best of health. I welcome you in my class that is English for Grade Two. We are learning Unit Three. Its title is Transportation. My dear fellow teacher, this lesson plan, PowerPoint presentation, worksheet links are given. You may click it, download it, follow it as it is, or modify it for your convenience. I'm going to deliver my lecture according to this lesson plan. Yes, my dear children. Under the title of listening and speaking, we are going to learn to take turns for oral interaction. Before this, in English for Grade One, I have already taught you the manners how to take turns. I hope you remember. Today, we'll extend the practice to demonstrate common conventions and dynamics of oral interactions in group to take turns. This is our today's SLO. Let's start. With the name of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, it's a beautiful hadith mentioned in Sahih Bukhari, Book Forty Seven, Book of Gifts, Hadith Two Five Seven One. The Prophet Hazrat Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, "The persons on the right side, so start from the right side." Very simple, you see. Our beloved Prophet Hazrat Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam taught us everything through his actions, through his words. So what he is saying, whenever you are going to start something, start from the right side. The fourth person on right side should be first. So we'll follow this rule to take turns today. Here is an activity in your book. So what this activity is? How to take turns? The topic dis discuss about different modes of transport and take turns. So, beta, how do we do it? One person puts a question and then takes answer from everyone in in a sequence. All right. So, the question is, which mode of transportation do you like? The first girl is Aksa. She says the best way to travel is through car. This is. Her. What she likes, okay. So when we are taking turn and we are discussing, we should accept each other's point of view. If she likes to travel in car, it's okay. You should not say why. It's no. It's boring. No, no. Yes, she likes it. That's fine. Okay. Let's see what the next child says. Next is Aisha. She's saying, I think traveling by train is very exciting and is fast too. Okay, that's also her choice. The next is Saad. He's saying, "I would like to travel on ship." Wow, I would also like to travel on ship. Okay, and next is Hamza. He's saying, "I like my cycle. I can go anywhere on it." You see, now everyone is expressing his or her point of view about the uh, the question which we put. So, it's your time. It's your turn. All of you will. Participate. Everyone will participate and wait for your turn. Speak nicely. Listen to others. Do not cut the conversation. And if you want to say anything, raise your hand and stay quiet. Don't say, "Teacher, I want to say something." I have seen students they raise hand, they keep speaking. But if you want to say, just raise hand and keep keep waiting with patience when your teacher asks you yes speak then start speaking okay so these are the manners we need to learn and it's activity time teacher you will make the students to sit in a sequence and as we learned a sunnah today we'll start from the right side the student who is sitting on the right side will ask a question and what this that question is your favorite picnic spot Okay, so all of you will tell about your favorite picnic spot, turn by turn. Pause the video, enjoy the activity. Yes, my dear children, all of you have mentioned good and very nicely. You participated. You are my smart children. Good job. So here I am giving you a homework. You will take a jug of water and a glass, serve water to your family members, and tell them. To start from right side is Sunna. Write the names of your family members to whom you served the water, and show these names to your teacher by tomorrow. It's a practical homework. All right, and here is a worksheet again, my dear fellow teachers. This worksheet 
lesson plan powerpoint presentation links are given you may click it download it and kindly provide printed worksheet to students for practice and students what you will do you will read this statement this scenario and you will select the correct option from here so in this way what we have learned today we listen this story like story uh, of picnics and we answered the questions about this story we learned and practiced to take turns in common conventions and dynamics of oral interactions right so in this way we achieved our slo to demonstrate common conventions and dynamics of oral interaction in group to take turns right so that's it for today beta the things which we learn we should practice everywhere wherever you are you should wait for your turn so tomorrow i'll come again with a very interesting lesson till that time keep learning take very good care of yourself thank you and allah Hafiz.